Alright guys, I've got a tire rig on the old right knot based on a combi rig. Um, just wanted to show you how I tie it. It doesn't come across very well because of my uh, the blueness of the camera. Anyway, um, hope you all stay safe. And uh, let's get making some rigs so that when we go out we don't need to make any. <laughs> right, uh, speak to you soon guys. Let's see how I do it. Cheers. Alright guys, I'm going to show you today how to tie a old right knot. A combi rig. I mean, you could use a slip D, anything you wanted, but I'm going to use a standard uh, knotless knot hair rig just so I can show it off, really. So, today I'll be using Supernova, which, yeah, it's a real soft uh, braid for solid bags, really, but I use it for everything. Absolutely love the stuff, love it. So, that's Supernova. Uh, I'm going to be using some wide gape box hooks in a size 5 and I'm going to use uh, some real stiff stuff so that I can show you the difference between the soft and the hard I'm going to be using mouth trap as the actual boom if you like so let's give it a go so first of all I want to make a standard hair rig let's just move this camera slightly I'm going to make put a little figure of 8 on the end this is just to say a standard uh, hair rig Get your hook, thread it on, like so. Uh, make it a single bait or something. Um, put it back through after wetting it. I don't know if you can see it. That's it, give it a pull, and there you go, that's a, a standard hair rig. Yep, standard hair rig on very, very soft braid. So, next part is to get your mouth trap, get a piece of your mouth trap. I've just cut one off actually, so here we go, get your mouth trap. It's very, very stiff. I know it's for charts and whatnot, all sorts of stuff, but you can use it as boom, you can use it for anything you want. You don't have to go with like a sheep. <laughs> Bend it over so you've got a just a loop, like so. Okay, so there it is, you've got a loop. You get your hair rig now, put it through the loop. Oh, grab all the loop first, I should say. And pull it through the loop. So you've got all three pieces together. Pull it right down. If I can get it right, sorry. Let me just do that again. That's it. Right, bring the braid through the loop. like so and then make it oops whatever length you want so I'm going to go for five mil here you can have five mil of absolute softness because when you pull it in a bit it'll go longer than that okay so there is a little soft bit so what you do is you get your hair and go down the rig, sorry, down the down the boom five times one, two, three, four, five. Okay, and now you want to go five times back up again back up to where you came from okay so you go one two three four five now this is the most important bit you must exit where you went in the way you went in so then put the end through where you went in through the loop 
like so. Tease it all up and give it a pull without putting your hook in your hand like I just have. <laughs> Tease it all up, give it a pull. Just keep teasing it up and pulling it. Give it a pull, it should be absolutely solid now. Okay, pull the tag in, give that a pull. And that should be it. So now, get these tag ends that you've got sticking out and cut them off tight. Tight to the Right, you're stiff. And do the same with the stiff stuff. Cut that off real tight as well. And that's pretty much it. Now, what you usually do now, obviously you'd have to steam this, uh, this mouth trap. I'm sorry if you can't see it very well. There's the knot. I don't know if you get it will focus on it or not. Camera's playing up on me lately. I'm due a new one, so. And basically, there's your stiff bit. Sorry, that your soft bit. And there's your stiff. And there we have it. Combi rig. Ow. Awesome rig. That's how you do it. So on here now, put some putty on here. Uh, to weight it down, you can have it pop up, bottom bait, anything you want. And that's it. Tie that off with a figure of eight loop or something. And there you have it. Soft onto stiff. The old bright knot. Cheers, guys.